Live from your local news leader, this is KTTC News. A show of support for veterans in the Albert Lee area nonprofit, the Chapman Foundation has partnered with Home Depot to renovate and improve three homes in the city to provide housing to veterans in need. Thanks yeah. for joining us. I'm Tom Overlake. And I'm Caitlin Alexander. KTTC's Matt Rainier was on site today to learn how this foundation has been providing aid for those who've served. Since 2009, the Texas-based Chapman House Foundation has provided homes for veterans across the country, and their efforts have expanded to Albert Lee. The foundation is now teaming up with Home Depot to fix three homes in the city. For founder Kevin Chapman, this project is another step for his foundation that started from personal experience. I always found myself uh, around a lot of veterans, um, generally huddling around a 55-gallon drum uh, with some old tires you know, burning to try to keep warm. So, um, you know, long story, but our veterans uh, um, deserve this. Um, they're heroes. Two of the houses being renovated will be used to house three to four veterans in the Albert Lee area, while the third's basement will be converted into an office space for some of them to work in following its completion. About 100 volunteers were pitching in to make this possible. We're going to be doing some painting, some new trim, new ceiling tiles, doors, fixtures, flooring, uh, to uh, make sure that it's up to par for, for these veterans who are going to be working down there. The foundation has also partnered with Jacobson Construction and Design, as well as Subway for this project. These organizations and Albert Lee's mayor, Rich Murray, agree it's great to know their efforts are going to support an important cause. They are excited to be here and do this. And, you know, they're, with that big of a group, they're able to knock out a project in very short order. And so this will be exciting to watch. We've always had a soft spot for veterans. You know, both of us um, have some family that we're veterans. And, you know, it just means a lot to know that the work that we're doing is going to go to a great cause like that. Reporting in Albert Lee, Matt Rainier, KTTC News. The foundation began its work nearly 15 years ago in Texas, serving several hundred veterans before continuing its work in Charlotte, North Carolina, and later South Carolina, before coming to Minnesota, where it looks to continue to provide homes to veterans in need.